Hey, Tai here. So welcome to the VR Tech channel. So app sharing and multi-account support for the Oculus Quest 2 is finally available. Oculus is gonna start to roll out the update today and we're gonna be finally able to share our games with other people. So let's get through the details in this video and let's see how it works. Let's get into it. All right, so while for some people the update is gonna be available already today, for some other people, well, it's gonna arrive a little later because it's gonna start to roll out from today, as we always use with the Oculus updates. But this update was for sure long overdue. There are some catches around and we're gonna go through them together, uh, but let's get through the description of this update, of course, to understand it together. So with multi-user app sharing, you'll be able to log multiple accounts into a single headset and share the Oculus apps that you have purchased with those additional accounts. So in different accounts, you'll be able to maintain your friend list, of course, browser history, uh, the privacy settings, and of course, all the other different accounts specifics. And then you can also add a privacy pattern to each account. So if you log in on a master account on another one, well, uh, you need the certification for it to be a little more, you know, private. But let's get to the details of this update together with what they call the fine print. So. Point number one, for now the admin account, aka the account you use to set up your headset, can add up to three additional accounts and enable app sharing on a single device. That means that the master account with the app sharing can be enabled on one single headset and not the other, you can have three uh, other people in your account on the headset. But if you have a secondary headset, well, of course, you're not gonna be able to use the app sharing with the master account Again. Point number two, to use multi-user and app sharing, the admin and the additional account holder must each log into the shared device with their respective Facebook account. So of course, Facebook account for everybody, just because why not? Point number three, additional account holders can only access the admin account holder shared app on the device where the app sharing is enabled. Well, we already said that if the additional account holder purchased their own device or already has their own device, they won't be able to access the admin account's share app on their own headset. So yeah, it's somehow limited to just two devices with the account share holder on it, one with the app sharing and one without the app sharing, if you wanna maximize the possibility. Point number four, additional account holders may purchase their own apps and content on shared devices, but these apps won't be shared with either the admin account or other additional accounts. So yeah, unless you are the admin account, you can't share that app with that friend, but just the admin account can share apps on a device. Point number five, you can still log into multiple devices at the same time. However, you will not be able to use the same account to run the same app across multiple devices simultaneously. Different accounts can concurrently access a shared app on multiple headsets keeping in mind that you can only enable app sharing on a single device at the moment. And that's very interesting because before it wasn't really clear and now we know that at least two accounts can uh, use the same game from a single admin account. So a single like a buyer of the app. So if you are using two different ads at one with app sharing, one without it, well, that means that you're gonna be able to use the same app even in an online app with uh, multiplayer on, a, on the admin account and at the same time with the other device with your account as an admin again, but with app sharing enabled and login in another account that is gonna use the app sharing there. Oh, that sounds complicated, but it's not that complicated. <laughs> other point, the admin account cannot be changed without a factory reset. The admin account can add additional accounts, but additional accounts cannot add other accounts. So app sharing applies automatically to all the apps on the store right now, with some little exceptions that uh, they are not actually talking about them right now, but they said they're gonna add also them in the future. So I'm curious to see uh, then what they're gonna be. Uh, but so far it's gonna work with pretty much everything. And the app sharing thing that we see is very similar to what we see on the PlayStation 4 or 5 or on the Xbox One or Series S and X. When you put like your home console in uh, your friend console and your friend gives you your 
his account to use it as a home console and so you can share both games at the same time and play together and so basically like just buy half of the games that you can buy you can do pretty much the same thing over here apparently but uh, there is a limitation that if you log in as we said before with the secondary account you can't share those games with your friend uh, because yeah it's not possible in this case so are you gonna add these uh, additional three accounts on the Oculus Quest 2? Uh, well, they describe this as well in the support page. So you have to go on settings and then for now go in experimental features because now it's just experimental and toggle the multiple accounts and library sharing. So turning on this feature will add an account option in the settings sidebar and selecting the accounts from the settings sidebar, uh, then you can select add account and add up to three different accounts that of course have to be Facebook accounts. So just to push some Facebook over over there. Remember though that those are gonna be just the secondary accounts. If you want to change the admin account, well, you're gonna need a factory reset. And that's not super good because uh, you're gonna lose some uh, saved games and stuff like that. So uh, it's not ideal, but uh, if you do it once and that's it, well, uh, you know how it works. Now, I think that it's awesome that they finally had the additional accounts on the Oculus Quest 2. It's such a shame that right now it's not available yet on the original Oculus Quest, so we have to wait for it. Again, uh, they said that they are gonna think about adding it in the future. Some people like me have an Oculus Quest 2 and an Oculus Quest 1 at the same time because they kept uh, the old one as well. It would be nice to use them both together. So yeah, probably if you have the admin account and then the app sharing on just the Oculus Quest 2, in that case, you can do it, but it would be nice to have uh, the possibility in both of course. Uh, the only thing that is not amazing is that this is limited to just two uh, devices. So you can have just one device with the admin account with app sharing on. But anyway, guys, that was all. Keep restarting your Oculus Quest 2 until the update uh, appears in the experimental features. Uh, that's what I'm doing right now. And I hope I'm gonna be able to show it soon or you already saw it in the video because that worked. Uh, well, it was restarting, restarting, and restarting. Uh, right now, that's the only way to force an update. It doesn't seem to be a big update with a big package, but uh, something small that they just push on every single headset. So hopefully it's gonna arrive very, very soon for everyone. But let me know what you think about it in the comment below. Uh, is this useful to you? Are you gonna share with another person having admin account on one uh, with your friend and admin account on the other with the other friend? So you have both uh, the same thing. Um, let me know in the comment below. But again, I think it's amazing that they finally pushed it. It's not the perfect way uh, they could do it, but well, uh, it works. It's better than nothing, of course. And then we can give feedbacks uh, to, of course, uh, make it better in the future. So if you have any, let me know in the comment below. So maybe they're gonna listen. But anyway, guys, as always, if you liked the video, like. If you didn't like this, is like. Subscribe to the channel for more of VR tech. And if you really love this channel, the join button down there. Little on further, also the Patreon with prior access to videos. Thanks again uh, for all the patrons that support the channel. And at the same time, in the description, we have a t-shirt sticker mask 2020 item, 2021 item number one. And uh, that's it, that's all. Like this, like, subscribe. See you guys next video. Thanks for watching. Ciao.